One man who reckons Trump's win has very real implications for Aussie politics is Tasmanian Senator Erica Baird. Senator, what do you think Malcolm Turnbull can learn from Donald Trump? Oh, look, it's not about Malcolm Turnbull or anybody in particular. The Trump election and the Brexit result in the United Kingdom is an expression of the people's frustration that political correctness is stifling their aspirations as to what they want their democratically elected officials to do. If only there was a sort of conviction politician, a strong conservative with a track record of standing up for what he believes, even if it is unpopular. I'm just going to throw it out there, Senator. Should we be bringing back Tony Abbott? Is he Australia's answer to Donald Trump? Look, I'm not going to make uh, uh, any commentary in relation to that. My party made a decision in September 2015 in relation to the leadership. That's resolved. We move forward. But I think there are general lessons, indeed, for all political parties. And might I add, especially for certain commentators who always sit high and mighty pretending that they know best. And if anybody dare disagree with them, they are described as a bigot, a racist a homophobe, a dinosaur, and they in fact use all sorts of offensive and insulting language, but it's okay for them, and they try to just silence the, the critics or those that might have a more conservative view of the world. What about the things that he said in terms of sexism, his attitudes to women? I mean, you're a conservative politician, you must be uncomfortable with some of the things that he's he said about women in the last couple of months. Look, uh, I think... Uh, Every Australian, if not most Australians, I would have thought every Australian uh, would have been concerned, and indeed in the United States as well. Having said that, I think the overreaction by some people actually assisted Donald Trump, because who of us can honestly say that they haven't made a lewd comment or an inappropriate joke at some oh, time I know a lot of people who past, wouldn't have made a comment like we... that, Senator. I can uh, vouch for the fact that uh, I haven't said something like that. Are there any Trump policies that you reckon we should take up here? Should we build a wall to keep the Kiwis out? I mean, they are stealing our jobs. Oh, well, look, uh, we enjoy a very good relationship uh, with New Zealand. We have closer economic relations uh, with New Zealand. And uh, I'm not sure where we would be building the wall, possibly in the middle of the Tasman Sea. But uh, <laughs> uh, we, would, uh, we, we would have a long way to go to b uh, build a foundation there. So I think we can give that a miss. Senator Abetz, thank you so much for your time. Great. Thanks a lot.